Breonna Taylor's family spoke out publicly this morning for the first time since a grand jury decided not to indict any of the officers for Taylor's death. I hope you never know the pain of your child being murdered 191 days in a row. Mm. Tamika Palmer. Mm. Mm. I am so sorry. Yes. So sorry you gotta go through this. Say her name! Breonna Family attorney Ben Crump calls the situation a grave miscarriage of justice. What kind of sham grand jury proceeding was this? Breonna's legacy will be that black women life matters too. The mood here in Louisville remains tense with more protest on the streets Thursday night. Demonstrations began peacefully but escalated after the 9 p.m. curfew. Police started arresting protesters, including some carrying hammers and spray paint. A local church offered sanctuary for other protesters, but police arrested many outside. Drive my car. Put him in the car. As protests continue, a lawyer for Sergeant Jonathan Mattingly has shared this video from the apparent raid in March that killed Taylor. It shows the moments after Mattingly was shot by Taylor's boyfriend, Kenneth Walker, who says he fired his gun thinking the officers were intruders. One of the Louisville officers shot during the protests made an appearance at work yesterday. Both officers are expected to recover. Cover. The 9 p.m. curfew will remain in place throughout the weekend. Jerika Duncan, CBS News, Louisville, Kentucky.